It's our great privilege to come to you this morning with great news. Would you believe it's been a year since we entered into lockdown and we've really adapted well to broadcasts and Zoom and all kinds of different things online. But I'm sure we're all a little bit weary at the same time. Well, this morning, I'm delighted to be able to tell you that things are changing. For the first time in a year, we have a clear roadmap out of this lockdown from the government. And more than that, I'm delighted to be able to share with you for the first time formally today that we will be definitely redeveloping the Riverside Centre, which will become known as the Reach Centre. And the work for that will start on the 19th of April, and we will be finished and ready to move into a brand new centre by September. Let me remind you, this is a project rooted in vision and faith. Reach is one church. We work out life together as a big family in many places, and we exist to bring heaven to earth. And we do this together because we are better together. We, we articulate our vision primarily around three words, plant, love, and grow. Let me just talk about plant. Every REACH hub exists because it was born from a vision to plant. That's in our roots and our DNA. We exist to see new things emerge, to think beyond what exists and beyond ourselves. Even in a year of lockdown, we've seen God working this out and REACH Malaga and REACH North Africa have already begun. And you played a part in that. Developing the Riverside Centre has always been about the whole of REACH. And we believe this fresh facility will help us to achieve the vision God's given us across the UK, the region and into the nations. This is a truly reach wide vision and project. Historically, our property assets have all been based in Derby, but we pledged that when we sold Juniper Lodge to Emmanuel School, the proceeds would be invested beyond Derby. We're really pleased to be able to say that that sale is now in the hands of the solicitors and we're well on our way to fulfilling that pledge. And the same will be true for all the proceeds that the REACH Centre makes, the possibility of having an engine for missions, and it's really exciting uh, to be able to uh, talk in those terms. So a year ago, we started looking for the perfect partner for the redevelopment of the Riverside Centre. We ran a tender process where we engaged six companies. We were looking for three key things. We were looking at best cost, capability, and of course, the all important chemistry. Now, ACI stood out from the outset as a great organisation and really from day one, Richard Year and his team have gone above and beyond in supporting us through the development process and we're really looking forward to partnering with them in the coming months as we redevelop our buildings. We're really proud to be working with REACH in Derby and we're a Derby company ourselves and working in the local area for the betterment of everybody in Derbyshire is fantastic. The moment I walked through the doors here at uh, Pride Park and spoke to the team about the project, it was exactly what we do as a business. Um, we engage fully uh, with REACH. Uh, we worked on the design hand in hand, um, worked through many months of, of, of due diligence and, and revisions to make sure that the end result is exactly what REACH needs going forward. Um, the facility by the end of it, in terms of the commercial side of it as well, um, it will be fantastic. Um, really happy and proud to be working with REACH. We are delighted to announce that we have secured funding from Reliance Bank. Reliance Bank is born out of the Salvation Army and even now maintains strong links, putting 75% of their profits back into the Salvation Army. They have a commitment to putting good before greed and people before profit, and we are really pleased to be partnering with them for our new mortgage. We have agreed a £1.1 million loan over the next 20 years, and the Payments for this will be made monthly and those monthly payments will actually be lower than our current monthly payments on our existing £550,000 mortgage with Barclays which will be redeemed. Isn't it great that we found a bank that's aligned with our values to love people? And the love part of our vision as a church is worked out in different ways. It's worked out in how we build community alongside people in need with our great REACH response partners. But we also want to see our love vision worked out in the new REACH Centre. We want it to be a place where people who don't know God's love experience His love and His care. 
We want to do that through the way we serve people, both in business and the public sector and others that come and use the building. We want to demonstrate it through the jobs we create and also the ministries that we run from the REACH Centre. We are really excited how the newly developed REACH Centre is going to be used to demonstrate God's love to people and that's what we're really looking for. We would love for you to be able to follow the progress of the project as it evolves. And so we've set up a page on our website to do just that. Just follow the link below. Um, we'll be posting key dates on that page as well as photographs as the project evolves. So we've touched on the expansive nature of our vision, the unity within it and the elements of plant and love. Grow is the next element for us. Grow is about giving everybody the opportunity to grow into the person that God has created them to be. It begins with a journey into God with courses like Alpha, but it includes emotionally healthy spirituality, the Celebrate Recovery course, uh, the Deeper course, and our partnership with the King's School of Theology. And I can now announce another exciting new partnership with the Westminster Theological College. WTC offers undergraduate and postgraduate level theological training of the highest reputation. You can find out more about that if you look at the link below. And Sean Dooley, as our lead for GROW, will also be the hub director for our East Midlands Centre for WTC. WTC offers certificate, diploma and degree level courses up to master's level, all accredited by the University of Chester. WTC also offers one-off courses which we're going to be promoting soon. WTC now gives us the next steps beyond King's School of Theology. This is going to be a great blessing to reach and it's also going to enable us to serve the body of Christ in our city and our region. Hi, I'm Lucy Papiette and I'm the principal of WTC and we just want to say how excited we are to be partnering with REACH on opening a new hub in Derby this year. It's just really exciting to be working with friends on a kingdom initiative to provide theological education and training to a whole region. So we're really grateful for this partnership. We're grateful for everything that God is doing and we're looking forward to seeing you face to face as soon as we can. So it's 20 years since we last as a church were involved in a major building project when we built the Riverside Centre. And so I am personally thrilled at the uh, sense of going into a new project and uh, investing in the next 20 years. So here we are. After a year we'll never forget, a year when actually the world seemed to kind of atrophy and become smaller and at this very same time God spoke to us about expanding the base of what we do in order to provide a foundation for even more work. We're genuinely blessed by God. This is a great church and it's long been in our hearts to be a church that doesn't just look after itself but actually is there for others. And also a church that starts other churches. Also, the idea now that we could train our own in our own backyard with the help of KST and also now WTC, Westminster Theological College, it's going to, it is immense. It's going to give us the capacity to have a theological soul, not just in reach, but also in synergy. This is a significant moment for our movement together. I really do believe we're on the cusp of doing something together with God that we've long yearned for and prayed for. These are great days. So we are now ready to enter the next phase of our journey together. And as we do so, if you're in Derby, you might be particularly wondering what's gonna happen during this season where the building is closed. That starts on the 19th of April and will run right through the summer. Just want to encourage you not to be concerned. We are working this out and we're praying it through and we will be in touch with more information soon.